What's happening everyone? It's Jeremy here with Cheat Day. Today I am trying the all new Italian mozzarella cheeseburger. I think that's what it's called. It's a new cheeseburger from Wendy's. Oh. It's got a beef patty, Asiago cheese. Check this out. It's on a garlic knot bun and it has marinara sauce. Oh, and a big patty of fried mozzarella goodness. So, like I said, marinara sauce instead of ketchup, mustard, or mayo. It smells really good. I also got some garlic fries. Uh, in the comments, let me know, have they done this before, garlic fries? I've never seen them. I thought this would go perfect with like a more Italian themed burger. And of course, they just came out with, I had to try this, the Peppermint Frosty. Believe it or not, I did not try the last one, the uh, strawberry. I just never got around to it. There's only so much I can eat without turning into a giant fat whale. But uh, let's try this freaking burger. I'm actually really excited. I make garlic knots. I was actually the first restaurant in my, the town that I'm in now to offer uh, garlic knots at my pizzeria. So anyway, let's try this. Hmm. I'd have to say right off the bat, it's uncharacteristically <clears throat> Wendy's. Uh, it, it really is like a garlic knot bun. Uh, the marinara, I don't know. It's not really coming through that much. I almost think it would be better with more possibly or maybe some marinara on the side to dip it in. It's definitely cheesy. I'm getting the cheese. The one thing about mozzarella though, it's not like a, it's not a very strong cheese. I've had customers before want mozzarella on their, on their cheeseburgers. I've had it before. It doesn't pop, but hey, you know, that's just my opinion. It's good. It's different. I'm honestly, <clears throat> I'm enjoying it more than I thought I was going to. They also make a chicken version of this. I didn't get the chicken version of this because I wanted to get this. I wanted to get the fries. I didn't want to do a mukbang video because I'm. I, I try to watch what I eat. Like I got the small frosty. I think this thing still has like 330 calories. This is the smallest one they have. The burger, I believe, uh, they do a double and a triple version. Uh, the single version alone is, I believe, 780 calories. You know. Honestly, I probably put 10 pounds on over October. So I'm trying to watch what I eat. And you know, the holidays are coming up. When it's cold out, you tend to want to eat more. <laughs> it was like, it was like 14 degrees this morning. It was 12 degrees a couple mornings ago. Uh, in the comments, let me know, how's the weather been where you guys are? Because where I am in Colorado, we've had some really cold mornings. Wow, these things, they look like they're covered in, I'm just saying what it looks like, I, I'm not really sure. I'm guessing it's probably some type of garlic butter with maybe like oregano. Oh, <laughs> those are good. Those are really good. Oh yeah. These are really good. I'm hungry. 
Those are good. I also got, when you go on the app, I recommend, you know, I said this about Taco Bell. Same thing with uh, the app on uh, Wendy's. The amount of options they have, it's crazy. I was able to add something I didn't even know they had. Ghost Pepper Ranch. Didn't charge me. Gave me three of them. I've said before, I love ranch with, uh, with my fries. I just want to see what this ghost ranch, ooh, I just got a little kick there. That's actually got some heat. I'm impressed. I don't know about the ghost, the spice with these garlic fries, but if you like spice, I'm guessing these are gonna go really well. When I say these, these uh, sides of ghost pepper ranch, these are gonna go really good with some regular fries. It's actually got some heat. I'm Like I said, I'm impressed because usually fast food, I can never get anything that I feel is, is hot at all. So I highly recommend these fries. If you're doing this burger, these fries would be the way to go because uh, you got that garlicky, more Italian cuisine type uh, flavor profiles. The burger, it's kind of dry. If you look at it, it's dry. The Asiago cheese isn't really melted too well. You got that that big fried patty of mozzarella cheese, and it's just, it's not really that saucy. I don't know if it was made correctly. I don't know if it's this is the way it's supposed to be. It's good, but it's a little dry. That, that's all I'm, I'm saying about it. I, I want more out of this because honestly, I think it's better than I thought it was gonna be. Pretty good. No napkins. That sucks. I like getting my napkins. Because it's so dry, I need something to drink, so. Let's try this peppermint. Frosty. Now, like I said, I did the small. I think they've got two other sizes bigger. Just watching my calories, so. That's thick. I can't even, I can't even get it through the straw. Oh, that's good. That's good. There we go. Mm-hmm. Wow, that's really good. My wife, unfortunately, would not agree. She does not like mint. I'm not gonna say these complement each other, but it's all pretty good. Now, the chicken version of this that they just came out with, um, I'm actually excited about because I believe it's Burger King is launching, I think it's today or tomorrow, a basically the the this in chicken format. So maybe, I don't know, later this week or next week, I'd like to do a head-to-head. -head. It'll be my first head-to-head -head competition on a couple food items. So see how they stack up against each other. Otherwise, I'd recommend trying it. Like if this sounds good, you'll probably like it. Uh, it's not knocking my socks off or anything. I really think it needs more marinara sauce. I think if there was more marinara sauce, this could be 
pretty, pretty darn good. The fries, two thumbs up. These are probably the best fries I've had since doing this channel. They're fantastic. You know what will go really good on this too? I'm pretty sure this is oregano. That being said, I'm not sure. It's not really sticking out too much. I'm, I'm getting more of the garlic. Anyway, there's some type of green herb on there. I'm having a tough time placing, placing it flavor-wise. For all I know, it could be like dried uh, parsley. But I was gonna say, you know what else would go really good on here? Is Parmesan cheese. If they shook on like Parmesan and oregano on top of the fries after it's buttered, that would be killer. But anyway, this thing is awesome. This is really good. If you like peppermint and you like their famous Frosties, uh, that's really good. The fries are awesome. The burger, try it out. Uh, if you know if it sounds good to you Like I said a little more marinara sauce. I think it might be It could be pretty awesome. Maybe not awesome. It could be better. How's that? But uh, otherwise, I'm gonna shut my trap now. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you hopefully very soon. Bye-bye